Now, after several failed attempts, plans to build a drive through coffee shop at a busy intersection in Springfield has been denied once again. Color 10's Parker Padgett joins us live there where developers hope the shop can go in. Parker, what's preventing that approval? Yeah, Bailey, no third time's the charm here. Many members of the Planning and Zoning Commission have said no to this, and they say one of the reasons is the potential traffic that would come with this drive through If the developer can come back with something that is neighborhood friendly, that goes in there, I'll be all over it. For the third time since March of this year, Springfield Planning and Zoning has denied a conditional use permit for a potential coffee shop at the intersection of Sunshine and Jefferson. Members of the commission and neighbors near the area spoke at Thursday night's meeting. The city staff, our team, the developer has shown that traffic is not going to have a negative impact here, and I feel that we've done things necessary um, to address noise. We've been up here how many times telling you it's a bad fit and you voted with us that it's a bad fit. I think it's time to put this to bed, do away with it, and quit wasting your time. You're a busy bunch of folks. This is the third time I've stood before you um, to discuss the, this particular proposal. In all three times, very little about this proposal has changed. And therefore, our objections have changed very little. I think that the circumstances have shifted, uh, in my opinion, toward a uh, even more reason to support it, primarily because the decision was made by city council uh, to rezone this to a commercial use, albeit limited use. Limited business zoning means an establishment can open as long as there's no drive through and has indoor seating. The conditional use permit is what allows a drive through a vital part of the seven brew business model. Even with proposal changes, the majority of the commission isn't sold. Seven Brew is a great product. It's a great business model. The problem here is it's the wrong fit for this corner. To say that a drive through coffee establishment is inappropriate on sunshine between Campbell Avenue and National to me is ridiculous. City Council is expected to discuss this issue at one of their meetings on November 14th. Reporting live in Springfield, Parker Padgett, Ozarks First.